Today we're in the town of Winchester, Illinois in Scott County. Scott County is one of the southernmost counties in the 18th Illinois Congressional District. We were invited to come to Scott today to look at some of the issues that are occurring in the community and at the same time to look at some of the solutions, creative solutions, that individuals in the town of Winchester are coming up with. Uh, there was a concern that came up just a few weeks ago because the local post office in town was threatening to close down. They were going to lose the post office in this community. Tomorrow, the only grocery store in Winchester is going to be closing its doors. In many respects, what's happening here in Winchester is characteristic of what's happening in many small towns and farming communities in western Illinois. We're seeing businesses that are closing, we're seeing young people who are leaving, we're seeing the hollowing out of so many of our communities. But the folks in Winchester aren't willing to give up on their community. A civic association formed here in Winchester. We're meeting today with members of that group, and this afternoon we're going to be visiting a farmer's market that's taking place, which is one of the efforts to rejuvenate this community, to bring people back to the vibrant city center here in Winchester. We'll take a look at that later today. We've so, spent a remarkable day here in the community of Winchester in Scott County, Illinois. We were invited to come to Winchester basically because there were certain concerns that individuals had about businesses in the community that were struggling, about individuals who were not finding economic opportunity in the town. But one of the things that we've discovered in Winchester is that there's a community spirit, a civic ethic that is so alive and well in this town and alive and well in communities across the 18th Illinois. What communities are doing is they're stepping forward. They're bringing forward new ideas about how they can develop their communities, about how they can invite people to come in to spend dollars in their communities. Uh, this is all about economic development at the grassroots level. And the Civic Association here in Winchester has sponsored its first farmer's market. Starting next week, there will be music on the square. We had an opportunity this afternoon to visit the Old School Museum. It's one of the most amazing museums that I've ever visited in a small town. And I would encourage any of you who are ever traveling through Scott County to make sure that you visit the museum. There's a whole lot of good things that are happening in communities like Winchester. And we want to do everything that we can to make sure that small businesses that establish themselves in communities like Winchester can thrive. We want to make sure that grassroots organizations like the Winchester Civic Association can have the support from their congressional uh, delegation to make sure that the, the kinds of initiatives that they want to establish are going to be supported and in, 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 in some respects that, that funding will be made available through grant opportunities and such so that communities like Winchester and others that have faced difficulties along the way can find a way through common ground, through common sense ideas through initiatives to bring their communities forward. It's been a wonderful day in Scott County. We look forward to being here again for the county fair later this summer. Good things are happening here. Please visit Winchester whenever you get the opportunity. Good people are doing great things here.